Let's make some salsa chicken. Yum! I'm gonna start by adding a half a onion and sauteing that a little bit. Then I'm gonna add in a yellow bell pepper. Okay, I took a very small corn cob, microwaved it for three minutes, and then I'm just gonna put it in there. There's some silk still on there, but it's just added flavor, you know? And I'm gonna toast it a little bit with the bell pepper and the onion. Okay, so I added a half a teaspoon of garlic powder, half a teaspoon of um, cumin, half a teaspoon of smoked paprika, and a teaspoon of chili powder. And I'm gonna add some more oil in here and get it stuck off the bottom, but you just want a little bit of flavor in. You can add um, vegetable stock or tomato sauce, whatever you want in here. I just add a little white wine because I have it, and then I'm also going to add um, some salt. And mix that around, baby. Yum. You can totally leave them in large breasts whatever you want. I just like them in chunks. First time doing it, but I think I like it in chunks. So, why not? We're not cooking them all the way through. We just want a nice sear on them. So, like, this one isn't moving. Well, okay, I moved, but don't move them until they need to be moved, people. Okay, it's mostly cooked, too. So, those brown bits are still good. So again, you're just going to add stock or white wine and or water, whatever you have, and just get them off of the bottom of the pan. Yum. Okay, so you can use whatever jam you have on hand. I think peach would be good with this, like peach salsa, you know, peach in it. I am using my friend's plum jam that she made me um, and my husband for our wedding. And I'm just going to put like three tablespoons in there. Thank you, Megan. Um, and uh, let it cook with the chicken, so. It looks delicious, so I'm just gonna cook that down. Oh my goodness, that looks so good. Okay, and then I'm gonna re-add the bell peppers, the onions, and the corn into that, and cook that down as well. And then we're gonna add the best salsa. This is my favorite, I love chunky salsa. I'd prefer mild, but my husband likes medium. We're gonna add in about half a jar of that. Whoa. Okay, and now you're just gonna sprinkle with whatever cheese you have. I think pepper jack would be really good on this too, but this is what I got, so this is what I'm using. Throw it in the oven at like 450 for 10, 15 minutes till it gets golden brown delicious. Okay, that was about 15 minutes in it, in the oven, but it looks so good. It looks so good. I paired it with some rice and some canned corn too, because why not? My husband and I liked it, but we definitely think um, fish might have been good in it, but I loved it. He wasn't such a big fan of it, but I'm going to improve it. So hope you guys enjoy. Have a good night.